because she's brindle and her father is red. Okay. So, you know, a lot of people think, well, if you breed a, two red dogs, you're likely to get red and that's it. Two brindle dogs, you're likely to get brindle and that's it. But there's always... The there's, recessive gene from the that's, grandparent, that's right? That's right. And so you can always hit... Like, I know somebody that had ten puppies out of two brindle dogs and had two reds in the litter. Okay. Um, so, and because the same thing with her, one of her parents was red. So she could have red So she too. could have red. Yeah. Because she's the, a brindle and the other boys are brindle, you know, the, the, the brindle is either, it's, it's got the red undercoat or the, the red tip. Yeah, nice colour. So you can get yeah, any shade of brindle. Yeah. Oh. <laughs> Watch those mittens. Hey. Are you ready? Give me kisses. Yeah. Mm -hmm. <laughs> oh, she's beautiful. I can't wait to see pups. Oh, you're cool. Yeah. They torment the lap. <laughs> We're just saying the same thing. They do on the runs when they're in the runs. The squirrel gets on the top and runs, runs along across. the bar on the top. Them. And they're going. <laughs> what they don't realize, the squirrels, that these guys can jump and climb over. <laughs> Yeah. Do you guys get coyotes out here? Yep. Yeah. And moose. Yeah. And big bloody moose. Yeah, he was just yeah. saying. They were the biggest retreat in the middle of Well, we, one comes up the drive. The one that was in here the other day was a cow. But we get a bull moose comes up the drive on a regular basis. Wow. And he just comes up and walks along the tree line and goes out in the far corner there. Huh. But like, the other day, he was at the tree. Well, we had another tree here, and they, they kill them because they eat the bark around them, right? Mm -hmm. <coughs> but, uh, he was up on this one where there's a deer. Yeah. And he's as big as a tree. Ooh! Uh, <laughs> no, probably about nine foot tall. These things are fairly passive. Tame. Yeah. Well, at this time of year, yeah. It's November that you got to watch them. Well, not like an elk or something. An elk is oh, yeah, an elk. Is, uh, well, it's their rut season is November, so that's yeah, when right. you've got to be real aggressive. careful about them. Yeah. Yeah, what's this? Oh, she's so cute. She's a dog. She actually, out of them all, she's probably the one that will be the calmest, but she has to be in. You know, if, if like, they don't bother me, it's her. We can have, like, we won't let the two boys run together. Yeah. You know, just not, not that it's a problem, we just don't want it to become a problem. Um, so, but you can have the girls, well, not her, because she's in heat right now, but... When they're not, you can have the uh -oh. girls out and one of the boys. And everybody gets along. Oh yeah, well they, they, they'll sit there with this one. If she's sat there and she's like this. <laughs> so she's got her head through here. And then she's okay and then she sits there. Winston has to be up on your neck. Aww. And then she sat, <laughs> you sat there with four dogs on her. Maggie, Maggie doesn't have to be on you, but she has to have one toe on you. She's you know. her she'll her she'll lay like this and she'll just put one foot on you like that. <laughs> But, um, but they're all on her and I'm on the other sofa just spread out. <laughs> What's wrong with this picture? <laughs> they love you. <laughs> Come on, Linky. Come on, Link. Come on, what did she call you? She called you a baby name. Say, my name's Link. I'm a big girl. <laughs>